Hey, what's going on, everyone? Dan the Glassman here. So uh, I'm just on a on a little trek here right now, and uh, driving around a Royal Hondo. So uh, this spot here actually is uh, a very old community, and I believe that my ancestors may have uh, been here, been from here. Uh, I found a book uh, from a. It was written by a Garduño, and uh, I'm my name is Daniel Garduño, and uh, and so uh, I found this book in the library and uh, started to read it. It was uh, titled The Royal Hondo, and so it basically uh, was uh, was based on our family heritage and uh, a few of the people, a few of the brothers who uh, first uh, lived here in uh, New Mexico and uh, how our family heritage started here in New Mexico uh, at least on the Gardino side of things and so uh, in the book it says that the two uh, brothers uh, one of them went north and the other one stayed around the uh, either Santa Fe Albuquerque area and uh, man this is a beautiful beautiful country out here so there's just uh, wild horses out that way I don't know if you guys can see that so beautiful a creek just running right through this home on the right here is uh on the rocks beautiful beautiful spot here We're going over another creek right here mini wachoni water's life and so uh <clears throat> my family uh or my ancestors uh they there's a lot of water here wow so they uh there's some horses uh, one of the uh, brothers went north to go look for some work and he ended up I guess uh, getting taken by one of the uh, native tribes and uh, they took him to Oklahoma and uh, in the book it says that uh, that they weren't sure if he was gonna make it or not that uh, I guess the tribe he was with they were considered cannibals I'm not sure if that's true or not check out this creek beautiful mini Wachoni. And so, uh, um, apparently one of the, uh, uh, the native ladies took a liking to him and helped him escape, uh, when, uh, the, uh, the men went on a hunt and went out for the night and, uh, got him a horse and then pointed in the directions of the Rockies and rode out with him, uh, to the Rockies. So, um, that's, uh, that's what the story says and how the story goes. Uh, in the book and I guess it's been passed down from generation to generation uh, told from a uh, you know um, grandmother and a grandmother to grandmother to grandmother um, so wow there's so much water over here and uh, so uh, he uh, ended up finding work up in Colorado area and ended up building a lot of churches a lot of um, bridges and and uh, things like that and uh, beautiful uh, geodome there and so uh, they, he came back down to find his brother and, he, uh, and then uh, they ended up settling in this spot here, Arroyo Hondo. And so Arroyo Hondo, I believe, was purchased by the, the family of the Gardunios uh, long, long ago. So I'm driving through here right now. It's the first time I've ever actually driven through. I've actually driven past it many times. Um, but there's a street here that I believe is a Gardenio Road or Gardenio Avenue or Gardenio Lane or something like that. So I was hoping to find it, but I don't know if I'll be able to because I've never been here before. So we're kind of just uh, driving around. I got a little bit of time, but I got to get into town pretty quickly here. And uh, Sanchez Lane. Yeah, see, I don't know. That's interesting. Here, I'm just going to turn around real quick. So, they have a lot of water right here. There's a huge lake in the center of town. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful.
and uh, yeah so that water is actually up higher so that's been dammed off and then there's a creek that runs down so that's really smart so they have the water dammed up right there so they can control the flow of the water and allow it to trickle through in order to sustain all these crops there's all kinds of different crops and things here uh, let's go up this road here V Hill Road let's see where this takes us it's a dirt road I think Gardenia Lane is somewhere up this way but I don't know I thought it was towards the center of town but I'm not even sure and from the maps maybe it looks a lot bigger than what it is here it's kind of it reminds me of like a res town right here This is really cool. I really like this. Yeah, there's no names of roads over here. No street signs or nothing. Oh, look at that. Gardunio Road right there. I found it. That's really cool. Gardenio Road right there. Let's drive down Gardenio Road. Huh. Wow. Where does it take you? I don't know if we're supposed to go up here or not. <coughs> wow, look at that old home right there. It's like a mansion. It's totally dilapidated. I don't really know if I want to keep going up any higher. I think it's going right to someone's home. Wow, Gardenia Goat Road goes all the way up to the top here. And then to where? <laughs> Gardenio Road. All right, guys. Well, I made it to Gardenio Road here. That's pretty cool. So I'm going to get out real quick. I'm going to take some pictures. This is a Royal Hondo. Gardenio Road right here. Turn around real quick. All right, you guys. I'll talk to you soon. We found Gardenia Road. <laughs> I'm going to get out and take a picture real quick.